The year was 2021. Bethany Christian School sat at a moment of peace before the storm erupted. There were only two instrumental music classes offered, band and orchestra, which have always been the perfect antithesis of one another. For years, Bethany had required music classes for all their students in grades four through six. So these students have been indoctrinated from a very young age. We have been raised in this conflict. It had gone on for generations and no one truly knew why. It wasn't even about the music anymore. It was too late when we realized who it had become. While there has always been competition between these two groups, it was in February 2021 when the tensions truly began to rise. On February 9th, 2021, a group of band members came across a lone orchestra player while they were both on a break. The band members seized this opportunity to approach the orchestra player and intimidate them with excessive amounts of jazz. There's so much pressure to make this lifelong decision to one side or the other. Sometimes I even wonder if I made the right decision. I play the oboe, so you know I'm pretty messed up. It's widely known that the orchestra is just superior. The band is so loud and obnoxious, and I'm not just talking about the instruments. In an act of vengeance, the orchestra launched a full-fledged musical attack upon the band during the fourth period. It was at this moment that the floodwaters were unleashed. Battles raged in the high school gym, middle school hallway, and even reaching as far as the locker rooms. But the center of the conflict remained in the middle school lobby, the land directly between the two nations. Little to no land changed sides here, but this was the front line where thousands of dollars worth of instruments were sacrificed. The orchestra recruited the debate members to help strategize their attacks, and the band recruited theater kids for moral support and little else. After the war raged for minutes on end, the directors received a message directly from Hank. The PTO had demanded a ceasefire after multiple complaints from parents. Both directors knew that the only way for this battle to end would be for these two extremist organizations to unite. We really needed to find a full orchestra piece. This uniting of music groups was far from ending existing tensions. Orchestra members would complain about brass instruments emptying their spit valves on the floor. And the band members didn't like to share their space. Nonetheless, the two groups were finally living at peace. Until the orchestra went nuclear. <laughs>